while we're sitting here. I was actually. <laughs> Man. Who put that there? <laughs> what do you got? So I was actually thinking we should. Well, I was thinking about this because we had these deep conversations the last couple of times, and obviously you got me thinking. Um, like, I don't want to go too deep with you right out the gate, okay. but like, what's your feeling or thinking on like the pyramids? Because we have these pyramids all over the world, and no one can explain how they got built, but there's all these really amazing <laughs> thoughts on how they got there. I mean, I'm talking scientific stuff. Even I'm, I'm amazed at like who these people are and they, their theories and they don't fully understand it. And they haven't uncovered everything. Um, so, so what do what's you the think? Question? Okay. So how do you truly feel they got there? Like what would, what's your honest opinion? How do you believe those pyramids arrived to be across the globe? I think they were built. By. I think they were built by people. I think that they were privy to technology that we are not aware of. The fact that they knew, I think our interpretation of how they built it is, it doesn't really seem very plausible. Like they dragged these stones and they're perfectly shaped and this took, you know. You can hear it now. You, what? Can, you can still hear it to this day, the dragging of the, of the stones. Yeah, you drag the stones with rope. If you drag these like multi-ton... <laughs> multi-ton stones you just dragged them with with a rope up a up a wooden ramp Dude. and it didn't break you know where also where were the trees where are you finding that like strong timber to build these ramps up on? i never considered that actually. Is that what, isn't that what they said they yeah. were ramps they rolled them right well, they rolled those like i'm there. pretty sure what they say is that the limestone isn't even from the area like it's not, it's not even, it doesn't even originate from there. It was brought in. So you brought in massive bricks of limestone that were perfectly shaped and then you assembled it. I'm not saying that it's not possible, but what I'm saying is that there was something going on there. Maybe an assistance, maybe there was an assist, you know, a potential. From another civilization or a potential an... extraterrestrial assist. That's what I would call it. <laughs> would you get attacked by a bug? Yeah. From another civilization. <laughs> yeah. I would say it was probably like, a, yeah, an extraterrestrial assist. Do you think it was like anti gravitational stuff? What do you? How do you think? Well, if they have a beam that people say they do, where they could pick you up, they could probably pick anything up. So imagine they just get a couple of their spaceships and they just have you seen the Nazca lines and all that stuff and moving it around? The Nazca lines. I mean, I, it's off topic, but I, the Nazca lines, that stuff you can see. I think they're in Peru. It's pretty. Know. It's crazy. You can see them like from space. Oh, those are cool. What are they like? Statues? You can see like it looks like an alien. Like if you come look from space and stuff, oh. you can see this stuff. It's what it kind of like. Why is that even there? It's though it, mm. it kind of piggybacks off of this. Yeah, they were like, "Hey, here's how to find us." Yeah, come on down. Knock knock. Yeah, <laughs> who's there? Um. So I was also thinking. So if these, why did these ancient civilizations help us, or why did they leave? What and that kind of stuff makes me question like. Where where did they go then? Where do you think they went? Where do I think they went? That's a good question. Yeah, you say that like we had a relationship and then like we got in a fight. And <laughs> you got like, broke up. Like, Fuck you. We're out of here. <laughs> Stupid. And they bitch. just like every once in a while we're gonna come down and just burn something. Yeah, like they are they just, back. Like, drop some Is this, are down. these the kids? Are these like the grandkids showing up? Yeah. Like, I, yeah. Hey, you guys were dating or something? That's a really that's a that's that's good to think about honestly. Right. If it's like this is like four or five generations of aliens yeah. later, where they're like, "Hey, I heard your parents. What are all these pictures? Like, I heard where you guys, were y'all? I heard my great great granddad was with your great great grandmom at some point. And you guys, were together, you guys were together. Y'all were chilling in some place called Idaho. <laughs> I know. I don't even know where that is. <laughs> it's like, but they speak English. That's the funny part is they don't. But I have to think of them speaking English. But I was like, what? Like, why is like? They were so open to that, with the pyramids, right? Because yeah. I wanted to see this is why I was asking. So I wanted to see what you would say. And you're like, oh, yeah, that's probably what happened. Well, maybe human nature is they gave us some sort of skills. And um, I'm just trying to wait. There's a jackhammer going on. I don't know if it can be heard. So I'm just giving it a second. from the aliens. But basically, <laughs> I think maybe the aliens gave us some skills. And you know how people are. We're greedy. And we could have been like, you know what? Like, we got them. We can, like, maybe we tried to get back at them, and they were like, you know, we're so much more powerful than you. Rather than wipe you guys out, we're just going to leave. 
because you guys clearly you have it figured out and we've just been lagging behind and they probably come by and laugh at us well i mean there's a lot to question when you start looking at these like missing possibilities and links going back 